Need to know how to create social media graphics quickly? In this video, I'm gonna show you how to do that, even if you have no graphic design experience whatsoever, all right? Let's get into it. What's up, busy people? Welcome to 5-Minute Social Media, where we help busy business owners cut their social media workload by 50 to 80% while increasing their results. How do we do it? We eliminate the tasks that don't make a difference. So if that's the kind of training you're looking for, take a second, hit subscribe, click that bell. That way you'll be notified each week when we release another helpful video. My name is Jerry Potter. Yes, it rhymes with the boy wizard. And in this video, I'm gonna show you how to create social media graphics quickly, even if you have no graphic design experience whatsoever. I am not a graphic designer, but thanks to tools like this, I do all my social media graphics myself without having to hire someone else to do them for me. And today I'm showing you one of my favorite tools called Adobe Spark. When it comes to creating social media graphics quickly, one of the things I love about Adobe Spark is you can see as soon as I logged in here, they have all of these pre-sized templates. So let's say I wanna make something for an Instagram post. I can click on Instagram post here. It already knows the proper size and it opens it right up. The other thing that helps people like you and I get started really quickly is from the beginning, they have so many templates. So I can come over here and search templates and let's say I wanna do something for an upcoming live video, a Facebook Live or an Instagram Live I'm gonna do. So I can go ahead and search live video and then immediately all of these different templates pop up. So as soon as you see something you like, you can click on it and then you can adapt it to match your brand or whatever you happen to be promoting or wanting to put on social media. So if I click this one right here at the top, lets you see it a little bigger before you commit to it and you go, okay, yes, this is what I want. I hit create, loads it up and there it is. And then I can go through and start editing it to make it mine. So for example, I might click on the words here at the top, click the pencil to edit. And instead I want it to say, Top Instagram tricks, hit done, and there it is. And now I'm gonna move it over just a little bit just by dragging and dropping. Now, I don't know who this woman is, but if it's my Instagram Live, I probably wanna have my own photo, right? So if I come over here to the side, I don't have to worry about the size or anything. I can just click this replace button and I can go ahead and choose from all of these different places, Adobe Stock, Lightroom, Dropbox, Google Drive, Google Photos, or I can upload my own photo. You can see it chopped off my head there, a little beheading, but I come over here and I click crop. And now I can drag myself down to where I wanna be, still filling that square that was already part of my template. When I'm done, hit the check mark there. I don't think I need that microphone, so I'm just gonna click on it and then delete it here by hitting the trash can. And finally, I'm not crazy about the yellow, so I'm gonna go through and choose a different color. There we go, that's better. And then finally, I wanna show you one more thing that I think is so cool in Adobe Spark is I've been able to upload my own logo and colors. So I can come over here to add and then select logo. And here you can see my logo is already preloaded in here. So I'm gonna go ahead and click on this one. It's gonna drop it automatically way down there in the corner. I don't want that. Obviously that doesn't look good, but I'm gonna move it up here onto the white. And then maybe I'll grab the corner of the graphic, make it just a little bit bigger. And there we are. So I took this template and I was going a little slower to show you how I was doing it, but literally you could make a graphic like this within a few minutes, which I love about the templates on Adobe Spark. So I've got this all ready to put in the Instagram feed. Maybe I wanna put it in my Instagram story. So easy to do. I come over here and I click resize and I can scroll down here and they've got these pre-sized templates. So there's one for Instagram story. I click on it and just like that, it automatically adjusts the whole thing for Instagram stories that I can go through if I want and make a couple of quick adjustments. Obviously you can adjust as much as you want, but the neat thing is you don't have to start from scratch when you're creating for something new. I wanna show you something else that's really cool about this particular program is if you are making graphics for your brand over and over again, you can store your brand. So I'm gonna click here on brands and you can see I've already got my brand in here. So it's got my logo. You can have more than one version of your logo. So this one has black text. This one has white on the bottom. You can have your primary colors, your color scheme in there, your fonts, so they're all ready to go. So once you've got your colors and logo and all that loaded up, you can access them no matter what you're designing, which is really great. I don't ever have to go back and look up this hex code in a document somewhere because it's already waiting for me because I've already put in my main brand colors. 
So since all that's saved, now I can go to create a project here and go to branded graphic. Then I go through and I choose the size of what I want. So let's do a Facebook event cover for this. Click on that, hit next. You can see it's already loaded with my brand color as well as my logo here in the corner. So it just makes things much, much faster. And of course you can change all of this, choose a new template, overwrite the entire thing if you want to. Now Adobe Spark has a free plan where you can get in there, play around, see what it's all about. But if you use my link in the description of this video, you can actually get a discount on the paid version of Adobe Spark. This is not a discount you can get on their website, so use the link below this video and get started with Adobe Spark. If this video is helpful, consider giving them a like, leave me a comment, I read every single one. Thank you so much for watching 5-Minute Social Media. You're not only supporting me, but also my two tiny superheroes at home.